Hi everyone, it's Friday, which is awesome. It's also Freya's Day, which is my favourite um, day of the week, favourite colours, purple, greens, pinks, um, and it's my favourite altar of the week, it's the one with the prettiest herbs I always think when I set it up in the mornings. So the last final day of this video challenge asks me to talk about the things that I manifest. So what do I actually bring to earth? What do I actually bring to life here on earth whilst I'm here? Um, to help me in this description, I'm kind of calling on my inner guardian angel, which as luck would have it, is all pinks and purples as well. So um, what I bring to earth, what I manifest, I would say is artwork to inspire and uplift people, sometimes to amuse people as well. Um, I bring to this earth compassion, understanding, and I bring to this earth a kind of warmth, I think, um, in the way that I share with others, in the way that I help others to achieve their goals. Um, and I manifest here on this earth a life that is good, honest, kind and fulfilling. Um, it's a life that maybe some wouldn't be happy with. It's a life that doesn't necessarily earn me millions and millions of pounds all the time. But it is a life that I enjoy and a life that I treasure and a life that fits with me and fits with my needs. Um, and I think really that's the most important thing. Um, so my manifestations my major manifestation, I think, would have to be um, my sisterhood site. I think so much of the things that I love are in that site. So making artwork, video to accompany this guardian angel is available on the site. Um, but my techniques for making all kinds of things, my inspirations and understandings of the world, my... Um, views and ideas on living more intentionally, my projects and inspiration for how creativity could heal, because it has healed in my own personal experience. Um, since starting to create art, I've gone from being someone who was clinically depressed to someone who is now much more settled, much more centred and much more whole. Um, <clears throat> so I think what I would say I manifest here on this earth would be my artistic endeavours, my hard work, and also my willingness to share my ideas and my techniques and my understandings with others. Um, so I manifest here on the earth a whole bunch of very happy students who now know what they need to do in order to achieve what they want to achieve, and I manifest um, some abundance for me to kind of go with that energy that I've given to them. Um, so I'm very happy with what I manifest here on this earth and I think it's really, really worthwhile and really, really um, important work that needs to be done. Um, I nurture my dreams very much. Um, in everything that I do, I suppose. I'm, I am a dreamer, I have always been a dreamer. I was often labelled as a dreamer as a child. Um, so I'm often a, what my mum would call away with the fairies, thinking about goodness knows what. So, um, but I, I do think it's important to dream and I do think it's important to make time to dream and make time to actually um, think about what your passions are, think about what your dreams are, think about what you really, really want to achieve. and to see whether you can actually bring those things into fruition, if you can bring those things to the fore. Um, so that's what I manifest here on this earth and I really hope you've enjoyed this five day series of videos. It's something quite unusual for me. I make quite a lot of um, videos that instruct people on how to do different things but it's unusual for me to be talking directly to the camera. That's quite a new thing. Um, but I've enjoyed talking with you 
and I hope you've enjoyed listening to my five days um, of what I bring from heaven to the earth. So my name is Sarah Leonard. You can find me and my online world at www.curiouslysarah.com. Thank you for listening.